Hi, Acadiana. I'm Dave Baker. It's Monday, June 27th. Here's a look at news making headlines today. Louisiana and some states now have abortion bans in effect due to the Supreme Court's reversal of Roe versus Wade. Three states have so-called trigger bans on abortion, Kentucky, South Dakota, and here in Louisiana. The bans went into effect immediately after the Supreme Court eliminated abortion rights Friday. Ten other states also have trigger bans, but they come with a set period or a step that needs to be taken by by state government entity for them to be implemented. Other states have restrictions on abortions that were originally blocked by the courts, citing the Roe versus Wade precedent. Those states may try to have the court orders lifted so they can have those restrictions go into effect. Louisiana law does accept, allow for exceptions for a woman's life if it's in danger. It also allows for exceptions if the fetus is medically futile. However, the diagnosis must come from two doctors. It also requires them to submit a report. In Jeff Davis Parish, Jennings police making a recent arrest in a homicide investigation. Tregan Citizen is facing a second degree murder charge for his alleged connection to a fatal shooting that happened Friday night at a convenience store. In St. Mary Parish, there will be a planned power outage this week in Morgan City. According to the city, the outage will last four to five hours starting at 10 p.m. on Thursday. The outage will happen in to repair an electrical feeder line that went down a couple of months ago. The new mayor and chief of police in Kaplan are now officially sworn in. Mayor Mike Klausel, Chief of Police Joshua Hardy and all city council members were sworn in. Even though the new city council current administration will not officially begin their upcoming term until July 1st, the mayor says it was great to see so much support at the ceremony. A lot of people from Kaplan came that weren't related to anyone here. And that's really good to see that you have the support of your town in that manner. It's, it's just huge knowing that what you're doing, the work that you're doing is appreciated and the work that you're doing, uh, people are behind you 100%. So it feels good. Well, temperatures today going to get to about 90 degrees, you're getting a little bit of heat relief here. This coming from showers and thunderstorms that are going to be arriving a little later on in the afternoon. And we actually stay fairly unsettled all the way through it the rest of the week. This week, we get a really good chance to catch up on some rainfall. We're going to kind of average 50 to 60 percent chances of rain kind of day in, day out. In fact, we'll go 70 percent on there for today. No washout days or anything like that, but each and every afternoon, I think we get a wide scattering of showers. Temperatures in the upper 80s and low 90s lows sitting down in the mid or 70s.